These new Mega Evolutions will ruin Pokemon Legends ZA. Here's why. Are you ready? Good! Let's get to pockets! Here are five Megas that will make this game smell like your crusty pits. Number one, Mega Delphox. Delphox is the first Pokemon that's going to get a Mega over any starter of other generations. Long story short, it's all Serena's fault. Not only is she a fan favorite and adorable, but they put that same energy on Fennekin and its evolutions. And for those that have a crush on this Pokemon, here's the gender ratio. Delphox has two versions of Megas, one that's Fire and Psychic, and the other is Fire and Fairy. Fire and Psychic would just be another Armor Rouge, which is cool, but its defense is atrocious. It has five weaknesses, and three of them are physical. Your second version has four weaknesses, which is improvement. However, you suffer in defense and speed. So if you let these types beat you in a foot race, you just let your waifu Serena down in every way. <laughs> Number 2, Mega Chestnut. Just like Delphox, Gen 6 starters are going to get Megas, which this Pokemon needs since it is the worst starter ever. Like, what else does this Pokemon bring to the table besides being garbage, not only in the game, but also in the anime? And I have to say, this Pokemon's very bulky. However, there's just one problem. The base stat total on this Pokemon is super unrealistic. Like, yeah, I would give it a 786 base stat total if I was trashing every little thing that I do. This base stat total is higher than freaking God himself! Overall, this Pokemon has six weaknesses, so if you do happen to have a flying type with good speed and hopefully swords dance, as a matter of fact, who wrote this crap? Number three, Mega Greninja. Y'all really thought I was gonna do Greninja? You can blame Pokemon for that. Cause Pokemon should have thought about it after doing a Battle Bond butt buddy to the worst protagonist ever. Whoa, calm down, Jamal. Yeah, that's right. I said that. Is there a problem? <laughs> Number three, Mega Aorus. This is easily the most forgettable Pokemon in Generation 6. So this gives every right for Pokemon to bring it back for a Mega. However, no matter what you do to this Pokemon, it will always be dog water. For one, you have the worst typing in the game, which is ice. However, data mines are keeping the ice rock typing for its mega. You have six weaknesses, and two of them are four times weak to your worst stat, which is defense. Although the design is beautiful, you could have done better on the typing. Maybe replace the rock with a fairy type, but just like fairy, they don't exist. Bro, who's calling? Who is calling me right now? Hello. English or Spanish? Baby, you got something to you know. Number four, Mega Noivern. Noivern is a fan favorite dragon in generation six. So it's the first to get a Mega. The stats on this Mega are solid. Great typing, four weaknesses, one four time weakness, which is ice. My only issue with this Pokemon is just the level up moves it gets since one of your greatest strengths is your special attack. Legends Arceus gave us a move tutor, which is in the village. Legend ZA gave us nothing. So if you have to rock with these moves the whole game, you better make the most of it. The last Pokemon was teased in the first trailer of Pokemon Legend ZA, and that is Mega Talonflame. Talonflame will easily get a Mega in the new game, since even the great bum trainer Ash Ketchum got one. So you know Pokemon has to please the golden child here. But they did this Mega so dirty. The base stat total for this one is lower than all the other Megas that I went through in this video. Besides speed basically being God speed, all the other stats are mid. Now this is where it thrives though. It has only three weaknesses, one of those weaknesses being four times weak to rock. But with your defense being what it is, you'll really need to survive a hit in order to take out the rock type. Luckily, this Pokemon does learn bulk up and Swords Dance, so you do have some choices on making it more dominant. But honestly, this design in Pokemon deserves better. These five Pokemon will ruin Pokemon Legends ZA, but let me know what you would add to these Pokemon if they were on your team. As always, if you guys enjoyed, make sure to crush that subscribe button, sand burial that shit, and you already know, join the Hidden Sand Village. Leave a like down below if you enjoyed this video, and as my lord and savior says, y'all stay up like a lamp, and I'll see y'all on the next video.